Good morning, Eve. Where are you? Because this does not look like your normal home because it's Padme's and Aurora's home. It is Katie. She's going on a cruise. What is your Caribbean Norwegian deluxe? My toes are just on her but toes. And it's kind of weird. And she moved her foot mid, mid the scene. She was standing on my foot. <laughs> um, we're going on an Eastern Caribbean cruise. Mm -hmm. So we're going to St. Martin, St. Kitts, San Juan, Puerto Rico, and Grand Turk. So, I'm going subscribe. to see all the saints. <laughs> yeah, we'll put travel, a link down below. A lot of travel videos to come Katie doesn't in the turn, next like, month. Katie doesn't turn travel agents. Travel channel? We're going to be travel, travel like, journalist. Watch out, bucket list. <laughs> Ooh. Just kidding. She's loving her life, loving her life. She has like more freedom than ever before in this big house. Oh. I had to log into one of our YouTube accounts and subscribe to a bunch of people so we could watch our peeps. They're gone. They have left. They'll be back in a week. Here's how I'm making my coffee. Struggle. Boom, boom. Put it in here. Put it over by the Keurig because I don't have a K-cup reusable and she doesn't have a coffee maker. We've showcased so many times Katie and Dustin's life is Chipotle. Dustin's biggest concern today about, he was going on a seven night, eight day cruise. Biggest concern was that he had leftover Chipotle in the fridge and he wanted to make sure someone ate it. So this is proof, Dustin, Sarah is eating it. We waited all of 10 minutes for them to leave, but <laughs> it's being eaten and loved and cherished. So we got Cody, Cody Warner on. We're gonna watch some funny YouTube. It's not like vlogging daily inspirational stuff, but it's because. I was thinking of a TV show. Oh, we're gonna start a new TV show on Netflix probably. But I had to show you my coffee because I'm trying that whole like steeping thing and it's not working out. And I really messed up this cup of coffee. And it's funny that it's in a Boston cup because I think when you make coffee this way, it's called Boston style. Um, but I think it's gonna be terrible. I think it's gonna be, I'm gonna drink it anyway, but I think it's gonna be terrible. It's milk. <laughs> it looks like straight milk. It looks like it's the same color as the mug practically. And while we watch this new TV, I'm actually going to not edit, but I'm gonna set up the Patreon, the Podbean, and the links and everything to get the podcast ready to upload. So I, gotta, I haven't done any of that stuff. This is the difference, and Dom, when you watch this, don't be offended, but this is the difference between like what Dom and I were doing with Park Hopper Podcast and what I'm doing with Vloggers Room is that when push comes to shove, like I'm gonna get this podcast up tomorrow morning, even if it means that I'm gonna record at two in the morning. So I'm gonna, it's only 10.40 in the morning, I'm gonna do the, like, the clerical stuff now, get everything set up, the account set up. Um, at some point I'm gonna record today or tonight, edit and get it posted, so it's gonna happen. Check out Vloggers View Patreon for info about it. Check out, um, nothing's gonna be on the YouTube tomorrow, but I do have a Vloggers View YouTube channel. I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to, I'm gonna do it differently than Park Hopper. So it's not just gonna be an audio file. I'm gonna have like filming of me speaking the parts. It's an evolving machine that I'm gonna love. What a beautiful sight. Look at that flag in the sky in Spaceship Earth. And I'm here, and Sarah's here, and we finally let the dogs alone to become friends. They've been together before, but they just yeah. need to get reacquainted. Back in. So we're heading up the DVC Lounge to meet two of our friends. Super yeah, excited. It is a dry heat today. It is a very dry, it's like 95, but super dry, but it feels good, but it's like heat. I just can't, I just can't get over this guy. Look how beautiful it is. And it's looking extra beautiful through the, the lens. With this heat and just like it being, the DVC lounge being open, I would not be against just sitting in there until six o'clock. Till they literally kick us out. And then we're gonna hit up food and wine. Don't know how much or what we're getting yet. I think I have to update our booklet. Um, it's gonna be, a, it's gonna be a, nice, a nice Saturday night. Crispy pork belly. It looks super small. But what? 
It looks oh, small, you're right. but I'm excited. Good. We'll see. We're back in the world showcase. I got this, this stew. We are with Keaton and Jordan. You guys want to wave in the vlog? Look, well, look at that, Crispy. That's way bigger oh, than ours. <laughs> Or this stew looks good though. Not Whenever we're with people, this happens. What happened before we were with people and they got with like. With Cole, he got like a massive slider. So Cole asked for no pickle. Look how big they made his. That's unreal. It's unridiculously large. Look at how little mine is. That is, that's a meal right there. <laughs> we got the noodle or pasta gratin. Is this just the bratwurst? Yeah. What's that on the side? That looks like regular looks mustard. Like mustard, yeah. We're a little disappointed. A little bit. But it's supposed to be really good. Yeah. I wish the bread was fancier, but that's this a big is size. Like similar to what they have year round at Germany, it just has onions and ham in it. Four twenty-five and five something. That was cheaper and looks better. Just saying. Not saying, but I'm saying. You can say it. <laughs> we were just talking about how we always forget to tell you guys what we actually liked about the food, or if we even liked it at all. So pork belly, always a good thing. Our portion was smaller, you get your but the beans are super cooking? good. Um, we definitely go back for it. And then the pasta gratin was awesome. Like, how could you go wrong with cheese and ham and onions? There was way more onions than we expected. But it was nice and crunchy. And um, again, like, how can you go wrong? Both A plus. Ooh, I said I want sauce. Hey. Uh, how was the bratwurst? I didn't have the bratwurst. Did you order it? No. I didn't eat it. No. I just, like, he ate all of it. No, no, that's okay. Dairy is not good for me. It's okay though, because I'm a bad person. Yeah. But how was the, uh, the Coke? The whiskey, yeah, the that coke was and good. whiskey, right? It was very good. It wasn't coke and rum, it was coke and whiskey. Like whiskey. Oh, yeah, this is very good. I'm a whiskey <laughs> drinker. <laughs> That's my choice. That's what Sarah said. Yes, I like craft beers, the coffee, and whiskey. Coffee, They're learning very quickly. They're bad influences. When you can't give me the window, you open up the door at all. When you're like, I think I kind of want that coke and whiskey, I'm like, you're gonna get it. Yep. Same thing I do with Sarah. Sarah's like, should we go um, to Disneyland, California? I, like, yes, we're going. Uh, Let's book. But we're bringing them, we're teaching them the ways of the festival center. They Have you been, You last time you were in this, was in the attraction? No, I've never been in a building. They had no idea that that existed, and then kind of let it. We are in festival center. They're handing out the Giordali. Paige, you're making my day. So Jordan and Keaton are talking, our DVC members too, so we're talking DVC. But first thoughts on the festival center. Oh my god, beautiful. This is beautiful. I don't want them to get rid of it, but I totally see them repurposing it one day because they literally don't use this building except for like this and a few other special events. I mean to be honest, but I know a huge amount of space. They could put like a ride where Body Wars was, but I almost just want this to be shops yeah, and like good food. Cool. I want it to stay the festival center, so make it like repurposable shops. Mm. And Ghirardelli always. Yes. Ghirardelli. They make fun of us for Ghirardelli. saying Ghirardelli. I didn't, I didn't make fun. <laughs> Asked why. Made fun of like, what are your thoughts on macaroni and cheese? <laughs> Ugh, gross. <laughs> People don't forget. Look, I got a Joffrey's coffee. Look at this. Please use trash in behind you. Thank you. Happiness Brew Daily. I didn't know this until the live stream this morning, so I've actually known it all day. Today is, today's National Coffee Day, right? It's National Coffee Day? National Coffee Day. It's coffee day. National Coffee Day. In the US. A doll hair of coffee right here. One dollar. <laughs> Sarah was jonesing for one. Please. Now it's time for Beverly. Who hasn't tried Beverly? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not, I'm not happy. Wait, you're gonna do it? Yeah, sure. Fill it up? Oh, well, I guess ladies first. I guess. Uh-oh. Peter's a pro. <laughs> Cheers. 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 The final meeting in person. Yeah. Guys, we're moving to Florida. Yeah. Woo! Absolutely not. <laughs> it lingers. Orange, really orange so all the way. Super different scene change. Who remembers Millie? We've been house sitting, or cat sitting, cat visiting. Millie, Kristen's cat. But she's ready to go. Like we're ready to go. She's ready for us to stop bugging her. So she's walking away from me like this. We're home, we're home, we're home, we're home. Here you go, puppy. All the dogs are good and healthy and survived and we're friends, we think. Look at this cool caricature Eddie got. Wow. Looking good, Eddie. Looking good. And right, here we go. I'm getting got everything set up to, to record first Vloggers View podcast. We've discovered the culprit of the issues with the dogs. <laughs> it's our princess of a puppy here. 
she actually gets along a bit better with Aurora than Padme. Padme is a snuggle bug. Padme was snuggled next to me, and, and Eve, Eve show just like demonstrate what Eve was doing. Cause Eve is so tough, but Eve was raising her paws towards Padme, and then Aurora would come over and be like, "Hey guys, break it up, break it up, break it up." Talking about you, little old lady. This girl's just laying on the table like she thinks that's okay. You got no home training? We teach you respect. Do you have anything to say for yourself? You look really gorgeous right now. So we got Netflix on. We chose to watch, or Sarah chose to watch P.S. I Love You. And it got me to thinking. It's been over a year and a half now, I think, since the last time I saw Quiet Man because uh, we lost it. I need to get that in my life. I don't even think I'm gonna wait for St. Patrick's Day to come around, or March. I need to find it, need to get it, need to watch it at least four times. Right, sir? Blind faith that one has in me. It's the best. Right? Right. See? Works every time. Could we go to Paris? Sure. Could we go to Australia? Russia? Yeah. Alaska? And Antarctica? Yeah. Ireland. I'm gonna show me my logo. Oh! Do we like it? We love it. But what is this? Dun, dun, dun. All right. It's super late. Way late. We gotta Too get late. up. We gotta get up early. Yeah. Because we're going to check out the Joy Beth and Josh's new church that they're they're joining or they're starting. Yes. That's the plan for the morning. So. Thank you again, uh, Jordan and Keaton, for meeting up with us finally. It was yeah. awesome meeting you too. And uh, check out the uh, Vloggers View podcast on Podbean. When this vlog goes up, we probably won't be approved for iTunes or Amazon Play, but uh, we'll get there in a couple days. Yeah, we have Podbean though. Yeah, Podbean. And YouTube, <sighs> Vloggers View. Good night. Good night. It's good to be home. Good to be home. Welcome to Vlogger's View, where we look at the life behind the lens. This is episode one of my very new We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>